I'm Storm Track 8 Chief Meteorologist Ashley Brown. Hey, looking at a great night for the Indiana State Fair. Temperatures falling from the 80s down into the 70s tonight. Hey, we're still warm and muggy, and we can't rule out a few isolated downpours tonight. So we're going to watch that chance for an isolated downpour as there is some rain out there on radar for you this evening. So that rain, it's isolated. Not everyone will get in on those showers, but I want you to know that the chance is there. As we look at Futurecast, our forecasting model here tonight, you'll notice those isolated downpours kind of popping up at times. Will dry out in the overnight hours, but tomorrow morning we're going to start your day with a little cloud cover. Hey, starting you out with clouds, but dry. And then we'll start to see those rain chances increase once again once we get to the late afternoon, early evening. There we go. We see a line of showers and storms slide across the area, bringing rain our way. Now, as this system moves into our area, yes. We will have the chance of some strong to severe storms in the forecast. So we're going to watch this line move through, bringing some heavy downpours of rain, frequent lightning, and gusty winds. This is tomorrow evening. We're under the marginal risk for severe weather. That means isolated, strong to severe storms are possible tomorrow evening. Uh, once that threat ends, we'll dry out briefly once again. Tomorrow, not as warm as today, but still very hot. 80 by noon. We'll make it to the upper 80s during the late afternoon hours, and that's that marginal risk that we talked about. Kokomo, Indianapolis, Shelbyville, Columbus were all. Included in that risk for severe storms. So, tomorrow, that lightning chance during the afternoon hours, the heavy downpours or strong winds, all associated with that weak disturbance that's sliding across the area. By the time we get to Wednesday, we're still warm with temperatures in the upper 80s. We're going to stay that way through Thursday. But by the weekend, just in time for the weekend, hey, we dry out. We cool down. We'll bring you a more comfortable weekend in the low 80s. You'll enjoy that greatly. But once we get back to next week, we'll do it all over again, bringing back showers and thunderstorms to the forecast by midweek. So this temperature trend goes down after Thursday and will dry out after Thursday as well. But keep the rain gear handy for much of this week as we'll track those scattered chances for storms.